So I guess it was kind of a good thing that the fact that um, I keep stopping my videos at the right time. You like I said, I do not. I'm not going to be skipping any main campaign uh, cutscenes, guys. Trust me, I will not be doing that in this game. I want to want y'all to be able to see every cutscene in this game, even if it's like me walking a couple feet to the next cutscene. I mean, y'all will not miss that. But anyway, welcome back again, guys. To the um, series. Hope you guys enjoyed the last 10 parts. I know this series is going longer than I expected. I know I because the reason why I can't make it like 40 50 minutes because you know it's gonna take me forever to render these videos. So, um, I, I have still have a decent PC, but I know y'all don't care. But at least I'm dropping episodes. Love y'all. Just keep doing what you're doing. The uh, main objective is to explore the, uh, the plane wreck with uh, Julia. And uh, let's go ahead and do this. Just remember to drop a like and hit that subscribe button on my channel and like i said guys i have bigger videos coming soon i have two uploaded and ready to go i'm just waiting for y'all go love y'all let's do this all right guys we're in this mess so we got to look at some stuff i saw something over here what's that really oh my god oh shoot Wait a minute, why is she seeing? Oh, don't tell me she gonna grab it. Okay, let's get out of here then. Oh my god. Stop your drum. Keep going. Just keep going. Do it. Do it. Come on. Hey, isn't that that dude guy that was chasing us? Uh, Olsen? I think we killed him, didn't we? Drowned. I'm sorry, but you did the right thing. It was him or us. Fuck! Oh my gosh, y'all. The frick. <gasps> the world is dead. Come on, get out of here! That's the dude was chasing us. Let's go! If you don't hurry up. God, guys, we gotta go. Come on. Oh, shoot. Come on, come on, come on. I almost freaked up going up the stairs, too. What does this mean? Does this mean we're over? Um, run. Just keep running. No, no, no. Jump it. Jump it. Come on. 
Holy frick. What in the world? You got an achievement, y'all. As long as you're quick. Um, keep going. Just keep going, bro. Don't fight back. Oh my god, this is really getting intense, y'all. Close the door, dang it. Get the frick out of here, bit. Oh, oh my god, oh my god. Maybe he's gone? Oh, oh, Flit! Oh, thank god. Yeah, it's me. Come on, let's go. Jesus! We gotta get somewhere safe. Good, the gang is back, guys. Holy frick, that's good. Are we good here? I think... Yeah, I think we'll be alright here. The curator again? Oh, hello. Things appear to have taken a turn towards the spiritual, wouldn't you say? Have you figured out what's going on? How to stop it? How to save the lives of your poor, unfortunate stowaways? You will, I hope. Although it seems the ship's previous occupants never managed to. Quite a lot of deaths that night. Let me help you out. Give you a little hint. I need some help. I don't want any spoilers. Yeah, why would I be here? I, I need some help. Nah, I don't want spoilers. No hint. Perhaps you think you can piece things together from the clues you found yourself. Good luck with that. Perhaps you've started to realize something. That everything and everyone may not be quite what they appear to be. I hope that helps. Well, aren't you excited to find out what your poor unfortunates are making of all this and how you might avoid any more unnecessary tragedy? Go on, back to it. Speak soon. What the hell is wrong with you back there? Brad, you lost your shit, like, big time. You almost killed me. What? What are you talking? Come on, no. No, come on, that's ridiculous. Well, what the fuck is going on with this ship? Because, I gotta be honest, it feels like there's some, like, like, evil, like, literal evil going on down there. Let's just stay calm and relatively sane about this, okay? The stuff I saw, it's like there were these old soldiers, and they were bodies, they were dead, but then they came alive and... That doesn't sound that crazy right about now. Alex wasn't the only Alex. What are you talking about? There were things walking around with his face on them. Alex's face, it, it was horrifying. Julia, I'd never hurt you. You know that, right? No, I know, it's just... This can't all be happening. Maybe like one thing could, but not all of these crazy things. It's too much of a coincidence. There's got to be something going on here. What can we absolutely be sure about? What do we know that's real? Um, there, is there a ghost ship fearful? Where's the gold? Um, is this a ghost ship? <laughs> Am I crazy or are we on a ghost ship? Like, ghost ships are real and this is one and we're totally on it and oh, holy shit, we're so totally fucked? I was going to say the same thing. 
Where are the crew? What what happened on the ship? Probing unsettled. Um, let's probing. What do you think actually happened to this place? No idea. I saw 1947 on the newspaper. Where's the gold? This place is weird. Yeah, why would I ask where the gold is? That's that makes no sense. This whole place reeks of weird. Dirty, stinky, weird. And I don't like it. It's like this place is stuck in a perpetual bad feeling machine. Where's the gold? Where are the crew? Um say nothing. We know more than we did before. That's something at least. We're wasting time. Whatever we do, we have to do it now. Time to get off this ship. We're not going anywhere without the distributor cap. The Duke needs it to run. Hold on. The ship's gotta have a radio. If we can find it and use it... That's great, but do you think it still works? Just need to find a way up there. Now, why would you go find, uh, okay, all right. We gotta get off this damn ship. We need to. No shit. I think we're, uh, speaking clinically, totally effed. Oh, yes, we are, Brad, yes, we are. Oh, my freaking God. Now we gotta go to the dang tower to find the um, thing. What in the world? What's this? Oh, it's a bullet cap. For a sniper? That sounds crazy, but maybe it was these guns that took down the plane from our dive. So if you didn't know, guys, this ship happened around 1947. So it's like two years after um, World War II. So it is, you could tell. You know what this ship reminds me of? You remember that Modern Warfare 2 map? Um, in the first Modern Warfare, that's what this map reminds me of for some reason. I don't know why. Especially if like you running through the little um, the cargo um, containers and stuff. It's ridiculous. But hey, man, I'm having a blast playing this game, and I hope y'all enjoying it. Sometimes I'm not talking because I'm too into the story, and it's like, and I got headphones in too. It's ridiculous. But when I'm like walking, interacting with the characters, I can start talking. You know, I'm just, I'm just enjoying this um, experience, and I hope y'all are too. Find a way up. Sadly, no, but I'll keep my eyes open. Alrighty, that seems reasonable. And why the heck would she just? Man, I can't go by myself. Wait, what's this? Hey, a little help over here. I think this is our way up. Give me a lift. I'll pull you up. Try and get everybody up here, and we can move further on. All right, we're doing this thing now. All right. You know, you know what I've noticed too, guys, when playing this game, the frame rate seems to drop a little bit, and the the way the textures pop up too in cutscenes. And I understand that this has been a—it's almost been a week since it came out. Um, well, it hit a week. Um, Friday from today, week um, from last week. And the textures just, it just sunk for some reason. I don't know why. It may be just my system. I don't know. Who knows? But that should be the main focus. All right, let's go through this door. Over here. Got a way through here. Oh, shoot. Come on. Keep spamming X. Oh, come on. Are we good? Yeah, them sound effects in this game really uh, crease the frick out of me. They really do. You see, you saw that. You saw that frame rate, guys. You see how slow it was. I don't understand why it does that. Wait, can I go through this door? Oh my gosh. Where did the team go?
All right. So the only person we have not seen in a while, guys, is Conrad. And apparently he went away. He would have been with us. But I chose the other option. All right, that door's locked. That's just from the other side, I think. So yeah, the only person we have not um, seen in a minute was our Conrad. So I'm guessing we're going to be seeing him in a minute. Find a radio yet? No, but there's got to be a radio on this ship. There, there has to be. I know they have to, but you got to realize how old it is. Ooh, what's this letter? Hold up. Let um, me look at this. United States Department of the Navy. I know y'all could see that, but um, uh, ship was blown off course. Cloud cover was bad. They couldn't establish a position. I drifts in shallow waters. Location unknown. Okay, that's weird. All right. Oh my God. I don't know where I can stop for a good point, guys, in this video, but we're gonna continue on. I, I I'll let you know. Oh my freaking goodness. Wait, I think this is it. Take a look. No freaking way. This thing actually still works? Well, radio science hasn't changed much in 70 years. As long as there's power. I'll give it a whirl. Alright, let's try it out. Let's see what happens. Ah, it's working. Come on, come on, come on. It's a number station. Oh my god. Is that it? Military bandwidth. Let's ask them for help. Hey! Hey! Is anyone out there hearing this? Hello? Over. Holy shit! We got him! Uh... Um, there's an emergency. Our coordinates are, uh, frenetic. This is an emergency. Come on, this is an emergency! Please! Um, our location is, we're on fighters. Oh, shoot. Our location. We're on an old freighter. Our location is 12 degrees, 30 minutes south. 151 degrees, 20 minutes west. Please get here now. We need help. Hello? Hello? Is anyone out there? Please, come in. Oh, no, it died. Oh, my freaking God. Hey, come here, look. Look. 